number four reason why I talk about sex is because I had a vision of hell and uh, this one was bad enough. This one was bad because the people I saw were the people who were called uh, by the name Christians who had fallen into hell. And many people have confirmed the visions of Christians in hell. And this is too bad. This is too scary. This is not good news. And uh, so uh, this specific group that I saw, they uh, I tried to plead with God so that he would have mercy on them but it was too late as that's the chorus and that is what the Lord will always say to those who have fallen into hell and then something amazing happened in their psyche and thinking those who are once pleading those who once knew the Lord those who once knew the Bible they started a horrible sense of blasphemy and I saw them showed the middle finger to the Lord and they said fuck you Holy Spirit this is the most amazing sense of blasphemy that I have heard and I saw it from believers who have lost their place in heaven and now they're in hell and when they realize that the Lord cannot do anything for them they blasphemed the Holy Spirit why did they go for the Holy Spirit because they knew the Word of God that there is one sin that cannot be forgiven therefore now because they realize that they cannot get out of hell they reason in themselves that uh, well we have lost out and so the only way we can hurt the feelings of God is to blaspheme the Holy Spirit and they did that and as I was thinking about that a revelation came to me about what Paul says in the book of Corinthians 16, 18 to 20, that all the other sins outside the body, birth, those who sin sexually, they sinned against their own bodies. The body is a temple of the Holy Spirit. So anytime that a man is sleeping around, what is happening is that they are abusing the temple of the Holy Spirit. And the temple of the Holy Spirit being your body, it means you don't respect the treasure within. The treasure within is the Holy Spirit. So, potentially the Lord spoke to me and told me, anyone that is playing around with their body sexually and they are believers, potentially they are blasphemous. So what you saw in hell is not strange. Always it was in their heart. There was a seed of blasphemy in the disrespect that you demonstrate and portray when you sleep around again and again, very well knowing that your body is the temple of the Holy Spirit. So this was amazing to me that I was actually potentially a blasphemer that if you don't respect the Holy Spirit's temple you are a blasphemer